Hey guys, welcome back to my video session. In this video, I'll be sharing with you some of the advanced searching techniques. While well, you might be thinking that it may be simple as uh, hitting Ctrl F, well, it can be, but there are a few other techniques that I'm gonna show you that we can use to enhance our searching techniques. Now, before I do, I would like to show you something in uh, Firefox. Here we are in Firefox. Well, it's not that I work for Firefox and, or I'm trying to promote Firefox. It's just that I like Firefox as much. Now, in Firefox, there is something called incremental search. We do that by hitting Ctrl F, and then when you want to search for something, it will search you for that. As you type, it will move the control over to that word. For example, if I type, as you see, it moved from visual and then I type studio then it came down here and then it came down to the express as you can see here so let's do that one more time I'll say I'll go to the top and then you'll know what I'm talking about did you see that it came from visual basic then visual studio and then it came down here so as you're typing it's moving the cursor so that's how it is you can even go for the highlight all you know you can highlight all the words for example you can omit the last two words and then it will say highlight all the uh, search words anyway so this is one of the ways that we can do a search in visual uh, in, in the firefox excuse me now back in the visual studio environment there is something called incremental search as i was talking about to do the same thing here what we can do is that hit control I that stands for incremental search and as you can see it gave us a little tooltip here and if I want to search for some word let's say DB command and if I type something else it's going to prompt me saying that command DA was not found so I'll just hit back so that's how it's done okay I have something called searching for searching for an occurrence for all the words that we have for example you want to know where all this now you want to find out in what all places this http context was used so what you can do is that just bring your cursor here and hit control f and it will show you where all it was used and it says that's it no more occurrence was found for example let's say this word cache and you want to find out what all locations in this source code it is used just hit control f and it will take you to all the places that it was used so this is one of the things and if you also want to find out the last searched item instead of going or hitting control f what you can do is that just hit con just hit f3 and it will show you that this was the last searched item that was used now instead of a search between in the files of in the folder or, or a project what you can do is that hit Control F and then you go right up here you select the find in files and then I'll bring it right up here and then here you can say look in entire solution or a current project or you, you can even choose the directory that you have for example if you want to search for a particular word or something in a directory let's say C directory you can cho you can choose to do so okay and uh, let's say I mean whatever you have you can just choose that and then you can use this uh, greater than symbol to select that folder and then you can hit the OK button and then it will only search for that particular button in that directory or in that target folder so that's how it's done thank you very much for watching this video I hope you'll join me in the future videos that I'll be making thank you